homes and cars spray painted in Port Richmond. Police are searching for the vandalism suspect caught on camera as neighbors try to make sense of the crime. Good evening. I'm Aziza Schuler. Nearly a half a dozen homeowners woke up this morning to find red graffiti spray painted on their homes and on their vehicles. Tonight, police are still searching for the person responsible. CBS News Philadelphia reporter Alicia Roberts spoke with neighbors who just want answers. Neighbors spent Sunday afternoon power washing and scrubbing their homes and cars along several blocks of Edgemont Street in Port Richmond hours after someone graffitied obscenities, symbols, and other words in red paint. I came home around 1, 1.30 to, my, to the garage and my house um, with spray paint all over it. Angela Wise's home security camera shows a man using spray paint outside her door. It's disgusting. We have kids around here. We have like children, like toddlers, infants, everything. Like they don't want to see that. Like parents don't want their kids to see that. It was definitely a shock. I almost started like laughing at first because I'm like, what's going on? Like this doesn't happen around here, I don't think. Beth Siegel and Matthew McMahon's house was also hit. They, like many, still don't know why this street was targeted. I mean, luckily nobody was hurt and like nothing was like seriously broken or anything, but it's. It's just, I mean, it's silly. It's ridiculous. It's very like, childish. It's, yeah, it's, it's, it's like very this childish. Is to, this whole thing was painted up. Tom Sheridan's work van was also tagged. Now he's just hoping whoever did this is held responsible. I just hope they catch him. And, I mean, it don't make no sense. Why, why would you go and do that all the way through all the damage people got to deal with? It's, people are struggling hard enough. And then you got to deal with something like that. Anyone with information is asked to call Philadelphia police. Alicia Roberts, CBS News, Philadelphia.